So often people talk about the importance of working on your business, not just in your business. And at JEDI, we support people in creating a business plan. But once you plan your business, you've got to work your plan. I want to talk to you a little bit about why it's important to do income producing activities on a weekly basis with your business. Spending time daily or weekly, scheduling time to do income producing activities is going to benefit you in many ways. So what are income producing activities? Well, obviously there any activity that you do that is going to bring you and your business revenue. So some examples, sales calls, getting in touch with people who are your prospective clients, your prospects, connecting with them in person or over the phone, introducing them to your product and service. And once you have those people that you're connecting with, those prospects, an income producing activity is also following up. Relationship building is absolutely an income producing activity. We want to build relationships with people who may be our promoters, people who are going to send us referrals, and building relationships with potential collaborators as well as our ideal customers and clients. So relationship building, we're all in the business of relationships. It will lead to income generation. Marketing implementation. Once you've identified your marketing plan and your marketing strategies, it's time to work the plan. So whether it's an email newsletter that you're creating and sending, gathering more emails for that list, blogging, maybe it's putting up flyers, whatever your marketing strategy is, networking, doing events, Implement the marketing. Get in front of your potential customers and clients and remember to ask for the sale. Have your call to action ready in any of your marketing implementation and strategies. And then finally, another example of an income producing activity, believe it or not, I hear this all the time, especially new small business owners who are great at their craft. They love doing their work, but invoicing and collecting the money can sometimes be uncomfortable for them. It is an income producing activity that's very important. So continually go into your accounts receivable, who owes you money, and remind them that it's time for them to pay you. Collect that money. Why do you want to do income producing activities? Well, it's obvious you need money to have a sustainable business, right? So we want to make sure that everyone has a profitable, sustainable business so you can get out to the world and offer the gifts you have to offer in your business. Why else? It builds confidence. Income producing activities are probably one of the greatest ways to grow as an individual and to build confidence. And then finally, it does create momentum. One of my business coaches always says to me, Joy, if you feel stuck, make a sales call. And it's true. I've tried that and just getting out there sharing what I have to offer because sales are serving. We're not in the selling business. We're serving and we're sorting. We want to inform people what we have to offer. We want to ask for the sale. Income producing activities, sales calls, follow up, building relationships, marketing, invoicing, and collectibles. Why? Money, <laughs> confidence, and momentum. So when you plan your time to do these income producing activities, Block out that time, turn off the phone, shut down the email, focus on your income producing activities and track them. Track them for your own self, be accountable to yourself and then celebrate. Whatever it is that you can do to celebrate the money coming in, if it's a big congratulations, if it's a mindset or if it's actually an activity, celebrate your success. Thank you for listening. Thank you for being a part of JEDI. If you have more questions, know that JEDI is here. And I just want to leave you with this one thought. May focus be with you.